Alright guys, uh, welcome to my first TF2 commentary. It's a solo commentary this time because uh, Scones, my the other guy on the channel, my, my buddy, he is busy. He's actually not in town right now, so yeah, I just hopped on a server. I figured, why not TF2? Because, you know, TF2 is fun. It's just a fun game to play, so I figured I would play it. And upload for you guys because I haven't put out a video in a couple days and I figure it's been too long. So, yeah. Enjoy. I'll probably do a couple rounds. Just like the bump. Uh, I got the heavy, but I got killed. So, it was worth it because, you know, heavy is a pretty hard guy to kill. So, when you can, you be happy. Um, so looking like I'm having some pretty bad ping. I'm used to, like, usually the server I play on. It's, uh, run by this guy, Star. He, you probably heard of him. have heard of him before. He, um, uploads G2 content a lot. And his server is, it's got a lot of really good people. And I don't want to, like, completely fail on my first video. So, like, what does this guy do? He was literally trying to kill the cart. No. That's not how you play. Um, I play TF2 somewhat frequently. My friend, he does not really record or anything, but he recently got into it, and so that's sort of gotten me back into it. And wow, the crit bazooka is real. You know what, props though. I don't see many people use that weapon. I don't use it myself, so. Yeah. It's good. So I hear and so I see. I actually um, tried to record earlier, but it turns out that I didn't have the hotkey to pause recording enabled, and there was like 10 minutes of just complete silence while I waited for rounds to start and stuff, and server connection. And getting people in the game, so I figured I would just do it again, try not to have it completely fail. I mean, usually I try to do that, but this time I had to be tried specifically, because I'm that bad. Alright, drop the heavy again, he doesn't actually seem very good. I'm not very good at this game myself, but... Whoa. Okay. Apparently, when I hit him with the market gardener, it didn't do anything. <clears throat> but, yeah, I'm not very good at this game. I'm not the greatest, but I figured I'd share. I mean, enjoy it. So, why not, right? Um, this team that we are fighting against seems pretty abysmal. Like... They haven't moved the cart at all, really. It's moving backwards, and it's like steps away from where they spawn, so I have no idea what's going on with them, because, oh, there we go. There we go, a little bit of, you know, not being completely steamrolled. Although, just because they kill me does not mean anything, since I'm sure I'm not the best person on the team. But we have three snipers and two engineers, so it's going to be pretty tricky for them, especially considering, like, in general, they just don't seem that good. They seem pretty new. Uh, I've played TF2 for a while, though, just not really, like, often. You know, I've had it installed since, like, 2011, 2010. But, I never really played it that much. Every so often I would go on little, like, kicks, but never that long, and never was I that good. Although I recently, like, improved a whole bunch as the soldier guy, because, you know, rockets. I used to always play as a scout, but I don't know what happened. Somewhere along the line, I became really, like, 
really bad at aiming the scattergun. I just couldn't hit, like, meat shots. Which are, when you hit them and it does, like, a lot of damage. When you hit them with all the pellets. I would just get, like, seven or six damage each time. Which is, like, less than you do with the pistol. So, I just kind of stopped playing with the, the scout. The Boston Basher. Uh, TF2 is a good game though. It's been around for a while. Like 2007, 2006, I think, which is kind of insane. That's like eight, seven or eight years. And it hasn't like had a sequel yet. It's had huge revamps and updates along the way, of course, but it's using like an old engine and stuff. So. Uh, you know, I feel like playing as the demo man. I'm not very good as the demo man, but he's fun, and I've been playing him more recently, my friend. So, yeah. And if the match continues, just like having nothing happening, I'll probably just cut to when stuff happens or a new map match, but with only two minutes remaining, it doesn't seem worth it. I know there's a beggar soldier up there, by the way. Ooh, gotta go get that help. Or, gotta go get destroyed. I am the lord. Wow. That... That seems a little egotistical there, but you know what? Who am I to judge? Plus, maybe he is the Lord. I have a feeling that's the... Like, yep, yeah, why? Why would he do that? Like, that accomplishes nothing. The loadout I'm using is kind of like funky. I've never really seen anyone use this sticky jump. Wow, he is just like wrecking my face today. <laughs> wow, I'm actually not doing as well as I thought. And also, it seems like they are pushing back, so I'm glad I didn't, you know, leave. Although, I'm sure our engineers are setting up nicely. Preparing to draw the game out as long as possible. Spy, leave. Please. Don't do this. No. Oh. I cannot believe I just got knifed to death. Like, I didn't even get backstabbed. Oh my god. Jeez. That's kind of sad. But, yeah. Sorry if I'm not being very interesting, I don't really have any subjects in mind, and he's just like completely destroying me. Like, this is embarrassing. <laughs> no, no. No. I'm not gonna switch. I'll just be demo until the round ends. And then I'll do a round of like scout or sniper or something. Just for the hell of it. to lose and I got jeez this spawn is here. Um I will get back to you at the start of the next round. Peace. Alright, so we're back and now we're playing King of the Hill on Nucleus. I'm not entirely sure if I gave the um 
the map last time, or the game mode, but I don't know offhand. I think it was Taylor's. And so, yeah, King of the Hill is fun. You just kind of, you know, try to keep control of a central point. While the other team is also trying to keep control, so it's pretty chaotic. Now this is a really cool map. It's got all sorts of like really nice looking and detailed things. It's an old one, I think. But it's not a very like serious map from what I've noticed. I mean, Team 2 is obviously not a very serious game, but it's not very like uh, competitive. I guess is the word. But it's fun. So right now the scout, the class I'm using right now is the scout. He um, gets shotgun or the scatter gun, which is basically a high damage shotgun with a whole bunch of like range, and it's got a good amount of ammo and a pretty high fire rate. And he has low health, and basically he just runs around and kills stuff and tries not to get hit because if he does get hit, he'll probably die. And he can jump twice, which is nice. So you can like get to hard to reach places or just sort of make it so your enemy can't really keep up with you. And don't miss. I'm not sure what this guy is trying to do. Maybe he's trying to mark a garden or something. He doesn't seem to be. Because he's not. He isn't like the guy who's. Oh, he's got the mini sentry. Are you kidding me? Mini sentries are just like such a pain. I. I'm not sure, but I don't think it's possible to kill them while they're building. So basically, you're guaranteed to take damage from them, and they hit pretty hard and fast, and they're a nuisance to kill. So if it's a situation like that, where you are on low health, you are going to die. Like, right there. I was shooting at that four times, I think. I hit them all, and... It still managed to hurt me. Mission ends in 60 <clears throat> seconds. And then the soldier stomped on my head. Which is different. Unrelated to the mini century. Pretty funny though. This guy is just leaving the spawn door open. I don't know why. This guy's being a jerk and utilizing the top glitch to his advantage, so you can't really predict his movements or understand like he's reloading or anything. Pretty rude. Although the talk glitch does look pretty fr pretty freaking funny sometimes when you do stuff. Obviously I can't show you because I'm a you know, first person. Alright, well that guy was AFK or something. And now he's dead. And he just completely wrecked my face. I think that's the guy I hit before with the uh, spiky ball. Um, King of the Hill modes are pretty short though, which is a good thing, in my opinion. It's just like a nice, quick game. You don't really have to worry about it taking too long. Although, most TF2 games are pretty quick. Uh, right now, it, it, right now, it may look like I'm just doing some sort of rain dance, but I'm actually, uh, waiting for the health pack to respawn, so I'm just, you know, going around in circles. Pretty silly. There we go. Looks like my rain dance works. Ah, uh, he went in the spawn. 
Guy accidentally killed himself. Stay when that happens. This guy's going for the close range headshot. Don't think that's gonna happen. It's pretty hard to hit scouts. Although some of them are pretty stupid and just sort of walk forward because they're fast. And then you can hit shot them as well. This is the guy who stomped on my head. I must have vengeance. Seems to be a pretty proficient rocket jumper though. Um, yeah though. Towards the end of the thing the game, it can get pretty intense, sort of. Do you understand what I mean? It's like frantic. Because both sides have a very low amount of time left up to win the game. Controlling the point. So they're basically trying as hard as they can to not have it captured from them. So basically, we need to capture now, or we can lose. Alright, so we got control, but now, if they manage to capture before the 30 seconds are up, they win. Perfect, we won. Alright, um... Sweet. I'll be back with you soon. Just kidding. I'm actually going to see you guys later. But if you watched and enjoyed, make sure you leave a like or subscribe to see more content. Not necessarily like this. I just sort of upload whatever. Whatever I'm playing, whatever. It seems like fun. But yeah, it really helps. It lets me know that people are interested and that I should continue doing this. So... Thanks for watching. I'm Biscuit. Peace out.